What's going on everyone, it's Kocha here, and I have a Senkaimon, uh, kind of a floor guide for you today. Uh, this is on floor 49 of the 4th anniversary Senkaimon, uh, clearing it under a minute using 1000 Year Blood Warwick and Pachi. And uh, I don't really have too many units on my account that can clear this uh, under a minute. I think I only just have the two, uh, Hakone, which I used in my video, and I was just messing around and I came up with this uh, strategy uh, using Thousand Year Blood Work and Pachi. I figured I might as well record it and upload because uh, anyone else who has this setup can um, pretty much easily replicate this. It's not too, too hard. Um, I don't think um, the slots should be required, but um, we'll, we'll get into it and you can see for yourself. Uh, so starting here, I have the uh, Hollow Baits, Pill, and Tension Tie, all 30% SP. Uh, two Senkaizen links and the resurrected fully hollowed Ichigo uh, max slots as well and that link comes in uh, handy near the end but uh, basically you want to just you know as usual use all your strong attacks off cooldown uh, I would recommend using them like this uh, starting with your first second then third so they come off of cooldown uh, in that order as well and uh, the NAD link with the fully holified Ichigo is actually really nice when your strong attacks aren't up. You can just NAD these down for the most part, and you can save your strong attack for a falling wave. But that's how you clear the first room. Uh, once you get into the second room, spam any strong attacks that you have, um, and then nuke the room. Uh, use your strong attacks again that reset, and then SA1 into the next room, the, the boss room. And then here, there's this weird bug with these transformation characters and that have resets on their specials. If you reset the app in a new room, uh, all your strong attacks will come off of cooldown. So you saw me reset the app there. You see all my strong attacks are up. So I just go in, spam all of them again. And uh, Grimjaw will kill me with his special. This is where the last ditch link comes up, refreshes my strong attacks again. And then I just spam them and it should kill him uh, well within time. And you can see here, uh, I clear it in 51 seconds. So there's uh, nine seconds to spare. I believe if you clear it in a minute, it's still okay. But uh, so I'm not really sure if not having the uh, link slots will make a difference. Nine seconds is a bit of a leeway, so maybe it's still possible. And here I have a little bit of a bonus run to show you using um, uh, Court Guard Squad Momo. Same build, full SP with Senkaisens, uh, no last ditch link this time because there's no point. But uh, I'll say in advance right now, this is not under a minute, but I feel like there's possibility here to maybe get under a minute. And you can see um, just how the run goes. Her SA1 is actually really nice if you line it up and it just pushes the enemies the full distance. Of course, you also have the burn on your abilities. So if you get a lot of burn procs on the mobs, they definitely help. Uh, lowering their total health down, but uh, you clear it like this, you should be able to clear the first room, uh, and then once you get into the second room here, same kind of thing as uh, Bankai Kenpachi, use your strong attacks, special, and then the last wave will probably survive, well I'm 1 out of 5 special so I do lose time there, but uh, you get into Grimjaw's boss room, and then here's like RNG really, um, the SA1 is good for pushing him away, and uh, also good for proccing burn. Uh, you probably need two burn procs, but you see I procced it there, I pushed him away, and I don't uh, I don't have another one, but... And obviously the timer's already gone past a minute, but you can see that it's kind of close. It's a minute and five seconds clear. And the fastest I've gotten with this uh, setup on Momo is a minute three seconds, and I wasn't recording unfortunately that time. But, uh, I don't know, I feel like maybe there's some potential there to get under a minute with her. Uh, the only things that would really change would be, or only things that would uh, make a difference, I guess, would be having an upgraded special. So if you have anything better than the 1 out of 5 special, maybe you can just fully nuke that second room and save a lot of time. I think that way you can get under a minute. Um, if anyone has a Momo slotted for whatever reason, if you have a level 10 link slot on her, you can get 20% more stats from the Mind Senkaizen, and you know, you would, uh, your NAD would hit harder, your strong attacks would hit harder, your special would hit harder, everything, right? So maybe that, uh, can make up the few seconds, because like I said, 
uh, with this build, my fastest was 103. So just the three seconds short, um, I feel there's some potential here. So, you know, depending on who it is, if you have special levels on Momo or for whatever reason you have her slotted, uh, I think this should be an option. Uh, but, you know, definitely give it a go uh, uh, if you have that setup or you have a better setup than me. And uh, let me know in the comments if it worked for you. I figured I just uh, might as well add this as a little bonus run. But uh, anyway, that's it for this uh, kind of guide, I guess. The only unit I was able to clear this under a minute with it was uh, a Thousand Year Blood War, Kenpachi. But uh, you can actually just clear this floor normally. Like, you have plenty of time to clear it within the full uh, three minutes. But yeah, under a minute, it's a bit tricky. Uh, but other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed and found this helpful. And I hope it helps some of you to clear this floor. And I'll talk to you all later.